hey guys welcome back to my channel i have another tutorial for you guys i feel like this was more of a daytime look but with still some color in it i wanted to do something with some green and some gold i hope you guys like this look if you do and you guys want to see how i got it please keep on watching so the first thing i'm going to do is go ahead and get my hair out of my face using a hairband now I'll be priming my eyelids using Benefit Stay But Don't Straight Eyeshadow Primer. I'm going to apply that directly with the wand and then just blend it in with my fingers. So I will be using a Deck of Scarlet palette throughout the entire tutorial. So Deck of Scarlet is a brand new palette subscription. You get a new palette every two months for $29.95. Each palette comes with three eyeshadows, two cheek colors, two lip colors, an eye pencil, and a lip pencil. So you get all that you need to create multiple looks. These palettes are also cruelty free. They're made in the USA and they're paraben free as well. So I'm going to go ahead and get the light brown matte in the palette along with the bronzer. And with the big blending brush, I'm going to go ahead and apply that in my crease as my transition colors and just blend it right in. This brush is from Royal and Lanchnickel. And now to prep my lid a little bit, I'm going to be using Dose of Colors Shell. And I'm using the cream portion of this eyeshadow only. And I was going to go with the gold and then I decided to go with the green in the palette. And I'm applying that directly on top. And now I'm just blending that out a little bit with a big fluffy brush so there's no harsh lines. So I'm like blending it in with the brown um, transition colors. And I'm applying some of the green back on the lid but more centered and lower than like higher up. And blending so it's a lot of going back and forth. Now for the pop of gold, I'm using NYX Cosmetics Gold Glitter and Eye Candy Cosmetics Lash Adhesive. And I'm just applying that in the center of the lid. I was using a flat synthetic brush, but I feel like your fingers would work fine. So I ended up hating the eyeliner, so <laughs> ignore that part. But now I'm just going to be doing my liquid liner. I'm using NYX Cosmetics here. This is their matte black liquid liner. And I'm just doing technically like a regular wing. I would say it's a little bit thinner and just more longer. Now for my liner, I'm going to be using Show Me by ColourPop Cosmetics. It's kind of like a bronzy gold color. And this I did like, this I did keep. And for the inner corner, I'm using the gold shade in the Desk of Scarlet palette. And I'm going back with the browns and blending that out in my crease. For my mascara, I'm using a Benefit Cosmetics Roller Lash. I'm, I feel like I'm always gonna say they're real. And it's not. It's roller lash. I don't know why I do that. Now for my lashes, I'm going to be using Vamtress by Shop by Levos. And by the way, the lash glue that I'm using is by a brand named Callas. C-A-L-L-A-S. And it's a really good lash glue. Priming my face with Benefit Cosmetics Professional. For my foundation, I'm going to be using LA Girl Pro HD. And I'm just blending that all in with the Beauty Blender. For my concealers, I'm using the Tarte Shape Tape in Tan. And then on top of it, I'm using Morphe Cosmetics Concealer in the color Oats. And I'm blending that in with the Beauty Blender as well. And for baking, I'm using Ben Nye Translucent Powder in the color fair.
fluffing up my brows with some mascara. This is Lancome Hypnos. Now I'm just dusting off all of the baking powder. And I'm going to be using the bronzer in the palette to shape up my face a little bit, give me some contour, some definition. Highlighting with Frankie Rose Cosmetics Contour Palette. And I went ahead and applied the pink blush in the palette and blended it in with a beauty blender. And on top of it, I'm using um, the Unfiltered One palette by NARS. And for the highlight, I'm also using the Unfiltered palette by NARS. And this brush is from Morphe Brushes. And I'm applying the highlight on the top of my cheekbones, my nose, and on top of my lip, applying some mascara on my bottom lashes. And for the lip color, I'm using the nude shade in the palette, and I actually fell in love with this color. It's like a peachy nude. It's beautiful. And I went ahead and lined my lips with their lip liner afterwards. I really ended up loving the palette. I feel like you could create so many looks with it. And that's it. I'm basically done with my makeup. I went ahead and set my face using Scandinavia. Putting in my contacts. By the way, these are Fresh Tone Premium Hazel. So I had a lot of fun using this palette. I feel like it's really, really good quality and a really good deal. I'll have the link down below in the description box to sign up for your own palette and also just more information in general. And that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys later. Bye!